Okay. Uh, Evert, uh, I'm, I'm tired of uh, doing presentations. I, I will leave, and, and you have a very rich and colorful presentation of yourself, so I will uh, let it to you, okay? Okay, thank you very much. Hello, everyone. I'm uh, Evert Feldhuizen. Um, just, just say that he deserves to be there, to be here. I hope so. I don't yeah. know. That no, you can I, decide that after I the presentation. So. I can say so. Um, yeah, I'm... Uh, does this work? Ah, yeah, it works. Oh, I'm going too fast. Okay, hi. I'm uh, Evert. Um, well, I'm a born Dutchman. I'm a, you <laughs> know these... Uh, I'm going too fast. You know these kind of guys? When it comes to soccer, I'm really still a Dutchman. But uh, actually, I founded my first... Uh, company in Italy, so I adapted also the Italian style a little bit. But um, as you know, um, the uh, tax department in Italy is not made for those who write invoices. And uh, after two years, uh, in 1999, I started in Italy doing web design. Uh, but I met my wife and she was working in Berlin for the government, so I decided to go to Germany because they have a better tax system also as the Italians. I didn't uh, want to stay uh, on the Lake Garda where I was living, so I went to Germany. And uh, yeah, as you can see, I really uh, we're became we're a German. We're not famous for low taxes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, no, not low taxes, but, but at yeah, least but it we is are not fair. Them, so. <laughs> um, so I became a real German, and now I have my uh, company in Germany, in uh, Berlin. It's called NetLead, and uh, we're doing some online marketing, consulting. Uh, we build a lot of tools for our customers, uh, work a lot of with the AdWords API. Uh, so that's the reason why uh, Gianpaolo asked me to, to speak here. But uh, I sp also speak Italian, so if you want to ask questions later in Italian, it's no problem. Um, yeah, why, I, why am I allowed to speak here? Well, I'm a nerd. When I play soccer, I have all kinds of devices, and I try to track everything uh, on my body, uh, my heart rate, my bag, everything. And uh, when I watch my, uh, my iPhone, I uh, see the cameras at home, and uh, I see my son is playing PlayStation 4 again, and uh, I can switch off the... Uh, power of his uh, computer, so he cannot play anymore. Uh, that's me. I'm a nerd. Uh, I try to automate everything I can. And um, actually, the first script that I made uh, was this one. It was, uh, I think, back in 2005 or something. It was a, a mouse click script that took an AdWords editor and, uh, and an Excel database, and basically it took data from the Excel database, pushed it in the AdWords editor, and then clicked on upload automatically. Uh, maybe you ask me why I did that, because at that time there was also an API, but uh, it cost money, uh, so you had to pay for all the uh, quotas uh, you used, and uh, I didn't want to pay for it, so uh, I built this mouse click script um, yeah, to save money at the end, but I also have to, to have the dynamic uh, search campaigns. And uh, I think that's a very important point in this presentation. I would like to talk about being creative when, you, when it comes to automation. Because uh, automation is good, but you, you have to think, how can I automate things? What, what results can I, uh, can I get? And think creatively about this. So uh, that's the title of my uh, presentation, and I have a little agenda for you. Uh, first, we're going to speak about a little bit about dynamic project management. So I'll give you some, some ideas, what we are doing, what others are doing uh, when it comes to automation. Then we will talk about real-time events. That's my favorite part. It's like the if this, then that. If this happens, what can I do in marketing? Um, and at the end, we are going to build an uh, automatically an account structure with ad customizers and upgraded URLs to new features that probably you all know already. Uh, some of them are since two months also in the interface. The other, both are just like about eight months now in the API, so they're, but they're pretty new features. But first, as we start talking about this, uh, maybe a little introduction. API and, and, and AdWords scripts, when do you use 